So hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Marie Johar Samuel. So for today's video, I would like to share about the biodiversity conservation mitigate climate change. Now if you are here first time in my YouTube channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe and please don't forget to click this notification bell below so you won't miss any of the next video. Now when we talk about mitigation, what does it mean? So mitigation is reducing the climate change involved reduce the flow of heat tripping the greenhouse gases into the atmosphere or reducing sources of these gases. For example, the burning of fossil fuel for electricity, heat, transport, or enhancing the sink that accumulated and store of these gases such as the ocean, forest, and soil. The goal of mitigation is to avoid significant human interference with the climate system and stabilize the greenhouse gas level in a time frame sufficient to allow the ecosystem to adapt to climate change. Now, protecting biodiversity can help us to adapt to climate change. A healthy ecosystem will be more resilient to climate change and so more be able to maintain the supply of ecosystem services on which our prosperity and well-being depend. Now, for the past few years, we experienced a lot of tragedies when it comes to environmental problems here in the Philippines, especially the climate change. Now, what is the climate change? Climate change is the overall atmospheric condition of a place for a period of 30 years or more. Here in the Philippines, we still have two cyclical events that we encountered, such as El Nino and La Nina. So, when is the El Nino happen? El Nino happen when the temperature in Eastern Pacific raise above the normal, and the La Nina happen when the temperature in Eastern Pacific decrease below the normal. So the climate change bring us a drastic effect to the some peoples and animals. So why it could be happen? Many experts say that human activities is the reason why the climate change is happen. So we people experience heavy rain, landslide, floods, and others. So in order for that, we must to work with rather than against the nature. So how can we protect our Mother Earth? So we must to preserve our Mother Earth by planting the trees, minimize the human activities that can destroy our Mother Earth in daily life, and then we must to apply the 5R to refuse, reduce, reuse, repurpose, and recycle to have save our home, our planet, our earth to be a better place to live in. I hope that this video will give you more knowledge about the biodiversity conservation mitigate climate change.